Hi guys, welcome to Bullet Gaming. Today I'm going to talk about the most popular FPS online and the reason it's so addicting. Many of you have already guessed it, I'm talking about Counter Strike Global Offensive, which has reached 4 million unique players this month and has an incredible daily average of 5 million hours played every day. In comparison, Battlefield reaches barely 30,000 players online at its peak. But why is this game so popular? Well, first it's cheap, you can get it for just $10 at the making of this video compared to Battlefield, uh, with premium which was about $120 at day one. Second is lightweight and it can run on practically every system, even laptops or a computer with integrated graphical cards. Third is not bandwidth hungry, you can play it with a 2 megabits connection without any issue. Fourth, it's a fair game. From what I've seen so far, except for 1.6 and Source players, most of the actual population is composed by Battlefield and COD players that got tired of their respective games. Let's say the truth, Battlefield 4 and especially COD are not fair games. Not always the best players wins. And when you invest a lot of time to become better at a game, this becomes very frustrating. Both games have too much randomness involved and should be played as casual games for fun. But what if you want to play a game where skill matters? This is where Counter-Strike comes into play. As a game is really brutal for newbies, but the perspective to split yourself from the average players is what pushes most hardcore gamers to become better. In this game, rank matters, and getting to the top is not easy as in Battlefield, where you just slowly gain points and gradually go up. In Counter-Strike, if you win consecutive matches, you get promoted, but if you lose too many in a row, you're going to get demoted. Even if it's not a perfect ranking system, I know, it's usually a good display of one's personal abilities. Every time you rank up is a real achievement, and since the game is going to match you up with players that have your same rank, ranking up will mean that you will face stronger players the more you go on because they are the best players that made it through the previous rank. In competitive mode, if you die, you will remain dead for the duration of the round. So team play is essential if you're going to fight enemies with your same skill level. If you're not careful and go face multiple enemies alone, your death can be catastrophic for your team. On the other hand, supporting a friendly by throwing a flashbang or a smoke to cover him can save his life and at the same time change the outcome of the match. Even shooting is a challenge with this game, you can accurately shoot only when standing still. Added to this, every weapon has a certain vehicle pattern and if you don't learn it, you will be unable to hit an enemy standing in front of you. When you start learning how weapons work and you feel you're getting the hang of it, you truly start to understand why this game is so addictive and begin wondering how far you can push yourself. One funny thing though is that if you master CS, when you go back playing any other FPS game, everything seems so easy. This makes you understand how much depth there is in this game. CS is truly an awesome experience and sure deserves the title of most popular first person shooter online. So, that was it for this video guys, if you liked it please rate, leave a comment or subscribe, let me know down in the comment section if you like CS content and wanna see more. And until next time, see you on the battlefield.